Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. <clears throat> Today we're doing another Shop My Stash. Um, I've had the products in my upstairs bathroom for about three weeks now. Um, and I'm ready to switch things out. So I also will have a new Love, Like, and Loathe video coming up with some of the new products I've been trying. Um, just trying to make sure I have my final thoughts put together for it before I put it together. Um, but yeah, for today, we will do a Shop My Stash. If you like this style of video, please go ahead and give it a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe before you go. Otherwise, let's go ahead and get into it. So a number of the products that I have picked out this round are products that are new to me that I would like to start testing out or are um, things that I would like to take on vacation with me when I go. We will go ahead and get into it. I'll start with complexion products first. Um, so the first one is a new product for me. It is the Smashbox Halo um, Tinted Moisturizer and it's in the shade Fair Light. I do really like tinted moisturizers, so I'm excited to give this one a try. And then I also am grabbing my NARS Radiant Longwear. I absolutely love this. I absolutely love this foundation, and I, I'm excited to put this back in um, my rotation. And then I'm also going to grab my tinted hydrator from Wet n Wild here. So I am really trying to... Um, use like the lighter coverage type products, especially when I go on vacation. I add this one in from Wet n Wild. Go ahead and add my Milani eye primer back in because I do really, really like this. And then for my regular primer, I'm gonna put in my e.l.f. Poreless Putty Primer. Um, this is one of my favorite primers. Um, just about every version of this, I do really, really like and use. For concealers, I'm gonna add in my Dose of Colors Meet Your Hue Concealer. Um, I really, really like this one, and I have shade 003 Fair, but this is a really, really good concealer. Okay, so I have a few different blushes picked out here um, that I want to try. So I have in the Buxom Wonderlust blush in the shade Mykonos, so I'm going to add that one in, and then I also am adding in the Nabla Skin Glazing in the shade Truth. Um, I picked up both of these in the 21 Days of Beauty, so I want to give them a try. I've been waiting to add them to my stash for upstairs. And then I also picked up, uh, or I'm also going to put in my Makeup by Mario brush. I like to have a cream option in there. This is in the shade Pale Petal, but I like to have an, a cream option in there in case I want to do cream instead. For bronzers so I have oh hold on I have one more blush here that I forgot about so I'm going to add in the cover effects blush this is in the shade peach um also I picked it up during the 21 days of beauty but I'm adding that one in as well they're all three different shades of blushes so I'm really trying to pick at least different shades when I'm adding things in Um, for bronzer, I have two bronzers. So the first one is the Skin Bronzing by Nabla in the shade Ombra. I think this looks beautiful. I am so excited to try this. And then also the Cover FX one as well. Um, I'm going to add this one in. This is the duochrome or the monochromatic um, bronzer. And then I and I'm going to grab the Makeup by Mario um, Cream Bronzer Stick in the shade Light. I really, really enjoy this one. And I, like I said, I like to have a good cream option um, in there if I want to use it. For highlight, so I picked up, I grabbed two highlighters for this round. So I'm going to add the one in from Jaclyn Hill um, and give that one a try. And these are two different shades of highlighter. So it'll depend on what look I'm going for that day, which one I'll be using. And the other one is the Glam Light one from Michaela. Um, I just recently got this in the mail as well. So I wanted to add that one in. So shimmery, so beautiful. <clears throat> okay, so for powders, I have a few powders that I'm putting in. 
Um, the first one is my under eye powder. I'm staying with the Pat McGrath one. This one is such a good under eye powder. It's smoothing, it's brightening. Um, it just, it looks amazing. And then I'm adding in the NYX Can't Stop, Won't Stop. Um, what is it? Can't Stop, Won't Stop mattifying powder. Um, I really like this as well. Um, and I just want to keep using it. I do. It's really good. And then the last one I'm adding in is the one that I recently picked up from TJ Maxx from Becca. Um, let's see here. It is the Hydra Mist um, Set and Refresh Powder. So I'm going to add that one in. Or my setting sprays. I'm going to add in the Milani Make It Last. I was trying to pick one that I felt like would be good long lasting for my trip. And I think this will be a good one. And it's it's not super bulky. But it's 16 hour wear. Which I will need. Um, for my eyebrows. I'm just going to add in my Milani. Let's see here. What is it? The Precision Brow. I really like this brow. Um, it kind of reminds me of ABH. So if you're looking for a dupe, that could be a good one. I'm going to add in a few mascaras. So this is the Wet n Wild Mascara, the Save from the Save by the Bell collection. Um, I do really, I'm trying to, there we go, Jill. That's what the wand looks like. I do really, really like this mascara. Um, and I'm, I'm sure you saw the other two that I'm adding in because I need three mascaras. But it's the Curl and Volume from... Um, essence here and this is what that brush looks like and then the last one is the new one that I picked up from it cosmetics um what is it the hello lashes and this is what this brush looks like so I am excited I the other two I already know I love but this one this will be the first time I'm trying it, so I'm excited to try it. Um, and then I'm also going to add in one other mini that I got. So this is, what is it? The Cover, X at, Cover FX High Performance Setting Spray. Um, I got it with the as like a free gift with the Duochrome Blush and Bronzer. So I'm going to add that in. It says it's 24-hour wear, so we'll see. Um, I'm going to add in all three of the lip products I got from the Michaela by Glamlight collection. You have like a pink, a gold, and like an opalescent there. So I'm going to add all three of those in. I have a lot of lips this time, which is surprising. Usually I don't. Um, I'm going to add in the long lasting liquid lipstick from Ofra in the shade Nude Potion. I'm going to add in my Milani Bullet Lipstick that I just got. Um, and this is in the shade Secret, 430 Secret. And then the last lip product I'm adding in is the one from Mented. Um, it's called Pretty in Pink. I'm going to get that one added in as well. So, and then the last thing that we have to go through is palettes. I'm sure you could guess some of the ones I'm adding in. The first one is the one from La Rock. It's the Noir one. Um, I'm going to add this one in, and I have to decide which one I'm bringing to Nashville because I will only bring one. I will. I'm telling myself ahead of time that I'm only bringing one. Um, and then there's the Born This Way, the Natural Nudes palette. Um, this one has like the pinks and the browns so pretty I'm gonna add that one in and then the last one that I'm adding in is the Natasha Denona retro palette I have been dying to try this one so I'm super excited um, to put this one in my stash all right so that is everything that I'm putting in my shop my stash this time um, if you like this style video please go ahead and give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe before you go Otherwise, just thank you so much for watching my video and have a great day. Thank you.